In this video, I'm going to show you how to finish up weaving your strips over the box and then adding a clasp if you're going to add the clasp and then removing everything from the box. So we have one strip left right here. We've woven all the other strips one at a time and we're on to our last strip. So we're going to pull this out. I'm going to just lay this flat because sometimes that last strip is always the trickiest one to get in there. Pull that nice and tight. Weave it under, over, under, and over. Make sure these are laying nice and flat. Wrap it around the corner and pin it. So the next thing that you want to do is just go all the way around the box and make sure you don't have any strips that are a little less tight. So if you do, just pull on them, pull them all the way through, up to the top, and then pin them in. Let's see if there's any other. You'll have one more time to tighten up uh, as you go. Now, I'm also going to check to make sure that uh, everything's at approximately a 45 degree angle. It doesn't have to be perfect. So I'm going to place the ruler, on uh, a line of the ruler on the bottom of the bag. And then just check to make sure that that 45 degree angle runs right up one of those strips. I don't know if you can see that with the... Can you get in there? So, uh, looks like everything's good. Now, on this bag, you'll notice that we're using a clasp. If you're going to use the clasp, the clasp is in two pieces. One attaches to the top. It has little uh, push buttons on the end of it. So when you push those buttons, the prongs on the lower part just slide into the holes and they're nice and secure. To open it, you just push the buttons. To place that on the bag, we are going to place that on this weaving strip right here. So the bag is going to have one, two, three complete diamonds, and then a half a diamond at the top. So if you look at this bag, it's going to be one, two, three. And the top of the bag is going to run right here. So you can either do this after you've removed it from the box or while it's still on the box. So I'm going to pull this weaving strip out to that third one, two, three diamond. Slide this buckle, or the bottom half of the clasp, on there and weave this back in. Pull it nice and tight. Now, after we've gotten this off the box, you're actually going to turn this uh, so that it runs horizontally across the bag. And you're going to stitch it so that the prongs stay up. Now I'm going to show you on this bag right here what I mean by that. You're going to have to get in really close. Can you see how I've stitched across here and stitched across here? Anchoring this so that the prongs permanently stay up. That's going to make it easier for you to close your bag. So that will be done after we take it off from the from the box. So now that everything's nice and secure, uh, your clasp is on, although you can do this uh, clasp after you've removed it from the box, we're going to be removing this from the box. So again, we're going to have one, two, three complete diamonds and a half a diamond. So when I take this off the box, I want to pin it above this half diamond. So I'm going to remove the pins and place them horizontally uh, 
above that line which runs all the way around here. So that line right here. Now this is pretty tight so I might have to adjust that when we when we take it off the box. The sides are where you're going to be the tightest, so that's not perfectly horizontal right there. Now I'll make sure that I've got one, two, three. We're going to have it horizontal right there, so I'm in good shape. Just want to be up above this line right here. Just right up above that line. Okay, so it should be loose and I should be able to tug the box right out from the inside. So we'll set the box aside. Now, your bag is still going to be loose. If I hold it up to the light, can you see those little spots in the bottom? So what you want to do is you want to tug on each strip to get it nice and tight. So on those areas where you've where the strips are a little short, it's very possible that you'll gain some length. So just tug on your strips. Now this is one in particular that you'll want to tug really, really tightly. Tug all the way around until you don't see those those lights in the bottom anymore. So if you can go in and pull from the inside, go ahead and do that. And just tug on them so that you've got a really nice tight weave. Now this purse can be made with or without a lining. So this one, this sample right here, has no lining in it. So you want to make sure that you've got that weave very, very tight. So just go ahead and pull on them so that they're nice and tight. And when you look at it, so you've got no holes in it. Then you're going to trim the top of it. And we'll talk about that in the next video. That's it.